Lightning is a powerful natural phenomenon resulting from electrical discharges in the atmosphere. The science behind lightning involves complex processes related to the buildup and release of electrical energy in storm clouds, primarily cumulonimbus clouds, which are tall, dense, and often associated with severe weather conditions. The formation of lightning begins with the development of thunderclouds, which contain a mixture of water droplets, ice crystals, and supercooled water. Within these clouds, strong updrafts and downdrafts occur, causing collisions between the particles. These collisions result in the transfer of electrical charges. Ice crystals tend to become positively charged, while heavier grapple or hailstones become negatively charged. The updrafts carry the positively charged ice crystals to the upper regions of the cloud, while the negatively charged grapple accumulates in the lower regions. This separation of charges creates an electric field within the cloud. When the electric field becomes strong enough, it overcomes the insulating properties of the air, leading to the formation of a lightning strike. The initial stage of a lightning strike involves the creation of a stepped leader, a series of rapid, invisible, downward-moving steps of negative charge that ionize the air, creating a path for the subsequent discharge. As the stepped leader approaches the ground, it attracts positive charge from objects on the Earth's surface, such as trees, buildings, and even people. These positively charged streamers rise to meet the descending stepped leader. When they connect, a conductive channel is formed, allowing the main discharge of electrical energy to flow. This main discharge, known as the return stroke, is the visible flash of lightning and is responsible for the intense light and heat associated with a lightning strike. The return stroke rapidly heats the air to temperatures of around 30,000 Kelvin, about 53,540 degrees Fahrenheit, causing the air to expand explosively. This rapid expansion creates shock waves that propagate through the atmosphere as thunder. Because light travels faster than sound, the flash of lightning is seen before the sound of thunder is heard. Lightning can occur within a cloud, intra-cloud lightning, between clouds, cloud-to-cloud -cloud lightning, or between a cloud and the ground, cloud-to-ground -ground lightning. Cloud-to-ground -ground lightning is the most dangerous type, as it directly impacts the Earth's surface and can cause fires, injuries, and fatalities. The study of lightning also involves understanding the different types of lightning phenomena, such as sheet lightning, which illuminates the sky without a clear visible bolt, and heat lightning, which is distant lightning that is seen but not heard. Additionally, rare and intriguing forms of lightning, such as ball lightning and sprite lightning, continue to be subjects of scientific research. Understanding the science behind lightning has practical applications in weather forecasting, aviation, and safety measures. For instance, lightning detection systems and weather radars help meteorologists predict and track storms, providing valuable information to the public and various industries. Furthermore, knowledge of lightning's behavior aids in designing structures and systems to protect against lightning strikes, reducing the risk of damage and injuries. Overall, lightning is a striking example of the dynamic and powerful forces at play in Earth's atmosphere. The study of this phenomenon not only enhances our comprehension of weather systems but also underscores the importance of respecting and preparing for the natural elements.